Are you okay? Doing better. I think you might be suffering from a bit of heat exhaustion. I was gonna pass it up for a second. I know. So did I. Are you gonna be okay? All right guys, so my all my attachment points for my uh, trellis over here is completely done. But before I start and go off and prime all of these uh, attachment points, I have to weld in a plate down here on the bottom of the shipping container. The reason why is because um, when I go to spray foam, there's nothing more than, what, half an inch down here before it hits the floor. So I wouldn't have anything to spray foam up against. So I have to weld on a plate. And that steel that I have, I have a sheet of 3 16th thick steel, like four by eight. Well, it's, I've used a little bit of it, but yeah, that, that's no fun to move around. That thing is surprisingly heavy. Well, we thought we were all good to start getting this piece of steel up here onto the container, but because the containers are used, they have bumps and bruises. And right here, we have a big old bump that Spencer needs to bang in before we can get the steel attached here, because it needs to be nice and flush, so yeah. <laughs> We have a new pet. Ferdinand, what are you doing in here? He's so funny. I'm pretty sure this is his daily routine now. He goes for a nice morning swim in the pond and then comes right on over here, gets his breakfast, and then just relaxes in the shade. I'm pretty sure he won't mess with the plants because they all have thorns, but still. <laughs> He's not supposed to be in here. Okay, so today what I'm working on is just finishing up the uh, trellis for the north container. But I wanted to point out, because I was cleaning up the uh, the welds over here with the wire brush and whatnot, and I gotta say, my welding skills have greatly increased. They, I'm pretty proud of this. Like, I think this uh, entire filled-in section looks really good. There's a couple few spots that got a little boogery but everything is I think it's pretty good so now all I have to do is uh, finish up the north container with its trellis and Ken's can prime everything and then it'll be ready for paint all right hold on before we continue I need to inspect it I don't know definitely a couple boogers
Today is a very exciting day on the farm. We got Spencer doing his thing, grinding away. Mackenzie painting her little heart out. Um, that's about it. <laughs> Do I look like one of like the NASCAR people? What? Oh, I thought you said, do I look like Crouchy? <laughs> I'm <was> Crouchy. <laughs> hey, buddy. Both of the trellises for these two containers are now done for this west side. We're not actually going to be attaching them yet because we do need to finish priming and painting. But now that this is all done, we can start on the south side. And as far as the south side goes with the trellises, it is a little bit for shade, but the primary purpose is just for aesthetics. It's not like we're covering the entire container or anything. That's why we're just doing the two small chunks, just because we think it'll look cool. So I'm just gonna be cutting up some of this uh, extra fencing. What I decided to do on how to attach it to the container is just cut a little excess out of it and then weld that to the trellis. And that way I have a surface to run bolts through. I'm just gonna take a bolt in the washer and a nut on the back side, And that's how I'm gonna attach it to the uh, shipping container. The welding over here is now all done. And something that I just wanted to clarify real quickly, these trellises that we're installing on the house, the only places that they're going are the two ends of the containers over there on the west side, and then just these two chunks. The rest of the side will be exposed. But now that all the welding is done, what we're gonna do is we're gonna work on extending the fence. You ready to get in the water? <laughs> yeah, I bet it'll feel good. So over the winter we installed the, the fence and we made our extensions from the physical fence down into the pond. And at that point in time, the water level of the pond was higher because we were pretty much in the middle of rainy season. So we figured the amount of that we went out into the water would be enough to keep the bull out and the other cows out. Well, that is proven 
to be not true. Now that the water level has dropped, he just walks around it with no problem. And there's been other uh, cows that have also have learned his secrets. So today we're gonna end that, hopefully. So what's your plan here? How far are you gonna go out? Uh, until it's over my head. <laughs> Got away, keeping me up most nights. It's always worth the sleep I sacrifice. And love is too precious to trade rested eyes. And you look beautiful in the morning light. Baby, seriously, you should go out as far as you can. Well, I should have probably took my shirt off. It's a little late for that. <laughs> guys, we'll have to get the peep show next time. <laughs> that was our version of Baywatch. Instead of coming out of the ocean, <laughs> you're coming out of a little pond. A muddy pond. <laughs> I never saw you as a pond fencer. Spencer the pond fencer. And if I fall blind, I will see you the same. I will always find a way to love you, babe. I will always find a way to love you, babe. Hey. Your mind wanders and your thoughts run wild But I will walk beside you every mile It ain't easy but it's all worthwhile I do it time again to see you smile So Hell Week is officially complete. <laughs> uh, the week of wearing pants for grinding and welding purposes done at least for the foreseeable future I don't know how he did it I mean there were days that it was definitely over a hundred degrees so it was kind of really bad timing but he got it done yeah. somehow I made it through <laughs> yeah so now all we need to do is finish priming and then paint and then we can get these installed yeah so uh, let me get to priming this before that Sun goes down yeah, right, and the bugs come out. <laughs> They'll swarm you because you're really stinky. <laughs> then why aren't they flying around you all the time? Oh. No lie, I smell really bad. <laughs> okay, ready? What a way to end a video, insulting my scent. <laughs> I will see you the same. I will always find a way to love you, babe. I will always find a way to love you. This is what I'm going to look like as an old woman. <laughs> you mean now? Oh, hell no. I don't know. Definitely a couple boogers. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Do you think I was funny? Uh, <laughs> Were you happy with that one? I guess I black out. I don't really notice. Okay, I forgot to press record. Don't freak out. We'll just do it one more time. <laughs> Your eyes just went black. <laughs>